October. It's just turned half past nine. I finished my six to nine work block this morning. I worked on ad creatives, client campaigns, and a few content pieces for clients. And that's everything ready. Two campaigns or two ad creatives published. I've taken out a few older ones that weren't performing uh, in the hopes of obviously these ones performing. So we're constantly testing with with different clients, depends on budgets and stuff, but that's exactly what I've done this morning. Now I'm gonna shoot off to Starbucks. I'm gonna get in another work block away from this office because the last two or so weeks I've just spent inside of here working, building out my campaign, building out funnels for that campaign. Um, and yeah, it's just been a bit of a grind in regards to staying in this office 12 hours a day, every single day. So it's good to change up the environment. Unfortunately, I don't live in a big city where I can make use of co-working spaces and stuff like that. I have to travel to the local Starbucks and work from there, which is exactly what I'm going to do now. So come along and I'll show you exactly what I get up to. <laughs> Lighting is pretty awful at the moment, um, so I do apologise for that. I'm not really spoken on here. I'm struggling. Um, there's toilet roll, there's tissues, there's some oil next to me. Uh, that's going to help me breathe because I'm under the weather, to say the least. That's why I'm eating these, to try and help me in any way, shape or form. Uh, but today's been a good, productive day. I've just been cracking on with work, to be honest with you. As you can see right now, it's pitch black outside. It's pitch black and it's half past five in the afternoon. So talk about that winter depression kicking in. Um, I think right about now is when it starts kicking in. The clocks went back yesterday. So it's, it's gonna get tough out here. Um, right now is one of the most important times of the year to kick your routine into place. Like you wanna have a really solid routine right about now. So if you're not got it on point right now, do everything and anything that you can. Wake up early, crack out early morning sessions like workouts or running or whatever it is. Exercise daily, try and get some sunlight outside, walks and, and all sorts of stuff. Otherwise it's uh, gonna be a struggle. So as I said, Today's been a productive day. I've worked on client accounts. I've set up new email automations. I've set up an email campaign for my agency. Uh, so we're gonna be doing call outreach through email campaigns. At the same time, we're pumping content and I've also run, I've also started running a paid campaign today. So this is the first day. Um, I'm probably gonna jump on that, this campaign and results in about two, three weeks time see how it's doing. Um, probably gonna run one creative per week and just test that way, see what I can do. The offer's gonna be, stay the same, it's just the delivery of that offer is gonna vary. Each individual creative is gonna have a different approach to that to that offer. But yeah, today's been a productive day. Um, as I said, it's half past five. My eyes are absolutely burning because I'm ill, um, but most of the client work has been finished. I think I have one more Add account to look over and have a look if there's any changes needed. Um, but uh, to be honest, that one's not really been touched over the past couple of weeks. So hopefully it's going to be fine. Um, but yeah, 
this is what a day in the life looks like. I switched up the environment this afternoon or this morning, worked from six till nine, had breakfast, switched up the environment to Starbucks from half nine-ish till about half 12 or one o'clock. I worked in Starbucks, came home, had more food, made that YouTube video that I'm right now uploading because I've edited it already. Pretty raw, straight to the point whiteboard video on how to stack your SMMA offer. So if you're interested, go and have a look. It'll be on my channel right now. I'm just going to carry on with more work. I'm probably going to call it a little bit of an earlier one today just due to the fact that I'm incredibly ill. And tomorrow is a push and cardio session, so I want to have as much energy as possible for that. Uh, because I don't really want to be taking any more days off. I'm currently cutting, and it's very up and down in regards to that, just due to the fact that I'm running a business, and I'm trying to run a business. Um, and yeah, it's a, it's a struggle. Personal goals and personal fitness and well-being tends to be impacted massively by the long hours of, of working at the desk. So it's incredibly difficult to um, to manage the two and make the most out of both. Um, but yeah, I'm trying my very best. I'm a one-man team at the moment. Um, hopefully we're looking to change that by the end of this year slash start of next year with the way I want to scale and, and grow the agency. But time will tell. We'll see how the paid campaigns do. We'll see how the called outreach does through the emails. And the offer, the offer that I have right now, I think, has evolved throughout the past 10, 10 months of running the agency. And it's really gone from you know, from just this, your standard lead generation to to everything in the back end system being implemented to help lead generation and to help to get appointments and book the appointments for the clients and, and make the most out of those appointments for specific industries and narrowing down your industries helps massively. I'm gonna finish this. I'm gonna crack on with more work. Okay, cool, so that's launched now. That's gonna go live tomorrow at nine in the morning. Sequence is from nine till six. Starting at 100 emails per day, and then we're probably going to scale that to 200, 300, 400, um, depending on the amount of leads that I can source and obviously plug into the system. But yeah, currently 100 leads a day. Uh, I think we've got around a thousand verified leads in the pipeline right now, so just send them out over the next 10 or so days, plus follow ups, etc. So yeah, it's just about constant trial and error. We've got a list. Send them out, see what the crack is. With this called outreach method, you can't really just send out a hundred or a thousand emails and expect to book loads and loads of meetings. Like from this, for example, this first initial batch with this initial script that I have set up, I might only book three to five calls maximum. Um, it all depends on your offer, etc. If you have a strong offer and you put that through very good, compelling and persuasive copy, then you're gonna book more. But it's just trial and error. I'm not the best at cold outreach, especially email. With cold email or cold DMs or cold calls, I've not done thousands and thousands and thousands of it. So it's still pretty fresh. It's still a learning thing that I'm doing. Um, but I guess you have to keep learning, right? And you just have to keep trying new things, try different approaches, different offers, different copies, and really just trial and error. Make sure that you don't stop because you're not getting results that you want. Instead, keep innovating, keep making things better. Um, and eventually you're gonna land on something that sticks and that's when you just put more and more volume through it.